Hello viewers, this is Adam New 1234.56 here, and today, since I am currently trying to complete a Fedora 11 Live CD download here, I thought I'd go ahead and chronicle my latest app, DLL Scanner, which is basically a user interface front end here for that batch file I released for the same video, which is basically chronicling dump bin. The nice thing about this is you don't have to have that batch file as a dependency. You don't have to have it installed on your system or at any specific path. You do, however, and in an obvious way, have to have uh, Visual C++ installed to be able to use the dump bin. And so that is also a dependency here. However, nice thing about this is basically it's a lot easier. So what happens is you just click Browse. You can find a DLL. Uh, you can double click it or click OK or whatever, and it'll fill in the path. Then you click scan, and it scans it for you. It doesn't take that long at all. And then it just comes out with the results. And so, as I said, you don't have to have the DLL, or excuse me, the batch file as a dependency. That's simply because what this app does, uh, something I've recently looked at, is a dynamic file creation. And so, what this does is it loads a file from within the application and it then s puts it into the form of a batch file within your temp directory and it creates it every time at runtime and then it creates or excuse me it destroys it and deletes it when you get done with the app so as you can see here I'll just click X and it's gone so you never have any static space taking up for the batch file. And so it's nice to remove a dependency. And so, neat little app. And if you do a lot of uh, DLL dumping, I have to encourage you to check it out. And so, I hope you do check it out. And I hope you find it useful. Adam New 123456 here, signing off.